Hello and welcome everyone, I am Luca and today we are playing Jurassic World Evolution 2. I wish we'd had more time to brief you, but as you know, the situation is fluid. Our Canadian friends are concerned that many of these wild animals are getting close to their border. We'd like to prevent <laughs> them from crossing it. We being the CIA. My division is the DSD, Dangerous Species Division. I'm Dr. Dua. I have an extensive oh, Dr. Dua. in paleo research in this Hello. very field. At Jurassic World, and now other locations I'm not at liberty to discuss. <laughs> However, I have history with many of the people involved here. Of course. She was in the uh, camp. First. What remains of it anyway? Amateurs. They only succeeded in getting themselves and others killed. And making our job that much more difficult. Well, this looks terrible. Dr. Dua, the dinosaurs are still agitated. Tranquilizing them would appear to be the best option at this point. Let's do it as safely and quickly as we can. Repairing equipment. No clear shot. Aha, okay, that's how it's done. One done, second done. This one's done. Now we need this one. That's kind of easy, if you ask me. We need just two each. Cardinals. Yay! Establish an operation Just facility. As an organization has key players, <coughs> me, <coughs> it also has key facilities that it needs to run effectively. So you should get started with the construction of an arrival building, a control center, and also a backup generator to supply power. I'm on it, and first we need to demolish all these things, because uh, I can't build anywhere. Um, as you can, as you know, if you watched the last episode, um, we have 10 minutes. They are tranquilized for 10 minutes. We have 10 minutes to build all these facilities. Arrival point, control center will be next to it, and then we need um, a generator which is in power. This is it. We have eight and a half minutes. Not bad, if I do say so myself. And I guess I am, but we're also going to need a response facility. Your response to this directive should be to get one built. Huh? You see what I did there, huh? Yeah, <laughs> response, I see what you did there. Response. Uh, never mind. Don't respond. Just build. Okay. It will connect to the our infrastructure beautifully. We have uh, seven and a half more minutes. We're good. We can build an enclosure. Claire, we need to get the dinosaurs into new holding enclosures. The ones we've already captured. Yep, that's right. And we'll want them awake and as comfortable as possible. <laughs> yeah, sure. And now we can just transport them inside. Um, we need to make ranger post. We need to add them some water. Where's water? Um, and of course they need some food and uh, they're carnivores. Um, can you please not get destroyed? You check them. They're missing sand. Where do I get sand for you? Painting? Sand? <laughs> I can paint it. Are they happy now? They're happy now. Hunt failed. Oh, poor baby. <gasps> poor baby. <laughs> Hunt failed because he drowned. <laughs> they drowned. <laughs> Facility is good. And what do we do now? What do they want? They had dangerous animals here? Correct, Mr. Finch. We know where they were. But now, Mr. Grady, it's essential that we know where they are. I know my dinosaurs. I'd say they're headed off in this direction. Which Do you direction? Know your dinosaurs, Mr. Grady? Better than anyone. <laughs> Better These are than not your dinosaurs, per se. Well, you're just gonna have to trust me on this one. Um, I'm very, very, very afraid to drive like this. To you know, um, find a dinosaur, a dangerous dinosaur. Um, this uh -huh. looks promising. Okay. You know, not that I'm promising anything okay what's next we are following the path 
of some uh, uh, animal. Um. Yep. Everything points in this direction. Large carnivore. Well, <laughs> I don't like that. It's just. I mean, I can hear something, but that's probably a herbivore dying, if you ask me. Another sighting. Say what you want about the dinosaurs, but they're not subtle. Wherever they go, they leave a mark. Sounds like someone I know. <laughs> Dr. Malcolm, because that guy, he is out there. Talk about an ego. Hmm, as opposed to... Well, you know, a certain lovable animal behaviorist whose humility has a charm of its own. Allosaurus? I feel like we are getting close. Really? You want to head to Allosaurus? Are you sure you wanna... Okay, I found a dead trike. No, it's just slipping. It's just slipping. I see the helicopter. And uh, we are getting dangerously close. Okay. There's so many. Wow. There's so many um, animals here. Look. Frikes. There's Brachia, I think. And here should be Allosaurus somewhere in this forest. If I am not mistaken, it should be somewhere here. No? First. Uh huh. Okay. Just be ready for anything, all right? <laughs> be ready for anything. Yeah, he will just jump out of the woods. I'm sure. I'm very scared now. Where is he? The helicopter is above us, so he is probably somewhere here. Oh. Ambush. Move quickly, not too quick. We'll trigger their instinct to chase. Now move, move. Owen, Owen, are you okay? What um. is happening? Little busy right now. Please tell me you have things under control. Do you want me to lie? If it'll calm my anxiety, yes. I'm a bundle of raw nerves. We're working the problem. <laughs> We're working the problem. Uh. We have a helicopter standing by, and they'll attempt to tranquilize the animal from the air. Attempt? Attempt? <laughs> we need success, Dr. Dua, before it can eat Grady and the others. No. Yes, one hit. You believe in the team, right? Yes, we believe in the team. Okay. Sedation successful. Uh, we need to build another enclosure for him. Owen, what's our status? We're close. Well. We have everything almost under control, but the animal is injured. We'll need to get her to a secure enclosure for observation and treatment. I'll notify Dr. Dua. Oh, me? I'm fine. Thanks for asking. <laughs> yeah, no problem, Lord. And the herbivores? What about them? As long as they stay away from civilization, leave them in place. They'll survive in the wilderness without our intervention, right? Given time oh, to well adapt. Done. Yes, I'd say they will. I guess that's something we're all gonna have to get used to. Having dinosaurs out in the world. Is that you talking, or is that the government? <laughs> I am the government. Oh, he is the government now. Okay, that's it. We have that. We have that. Um, security. This is here. Now we can um, bring him. Now we can transport him to a secure location. And the Allosaurus is here. Now all we need is him to descend. Okay, here he is. Now we need to perform a status check. It should be automatic. I guess it needs to be manual. I'm going to need a paleomedical facility to assess the status of the dinosaur that they're bringing in. We'll need to do a full medical scan. I want to understand what went wrong if we're going to avoid an event like this in the future. Okay, what do I need to build? Paleomedical facility, facility operations, missing forest. No, oh, you want more forest. You happy now? Missing open space. Great. Is this better? No, 
is missing for us now. Uh, this is going to be pain, right? Missing open space. I think my enclosure is too little for him, so we need to extend it. Why are you missing open space? Missing forest. I'll kill you. Missing open space. Come on. That's not funny. Missing prey. Okay. Well, they are very, very not easy to satisfy, if you ask me. Oh, come on. What did you do again? Stupid dinosaur. Here you have your prey, come on. Oh, finally. Finally he is happy with his enclosure. Sometimes what a problem requires is a new set of eyes. Let's hire a few scientists with the skills to diagnose these animals. Make sure they are competent with the MVU and can perform medical scans on the dinosaurs. I'm interested to see what we can discover. Wow, there are so many of them. I'm so lost. Okay, let's go with the f welfare of this one. Okay. We've hired more scientists for Dr. Dua, so we should have a better handle on the dinosaur's medical status. Hopefully we'll be able to figure out what went wrong. Hey, if I've learned anything, it's that these animals are unpredictable. Like people, but with uh, bigger teeth. Yeah. We should keep an eye on her. Right, right. Uh, who? Dr. Dua? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Yes. She's working for the CIA now. Oh, you'll be pleased to know I'm running a little intelligence op of my own. Looking out for the both of us. <laughs> You're a lot more astute than you let on. Smarter, too. Gosh. Okay, we need to perform a medical scan on him. How is that done? Mobile vet unit, you click on him, at task, and medical scan. Oh, we can also assign to this uh, control post. Okay, that sounds good. That sounds very good. Because then we don't need to... Um, they will patrol it uh, by themselves, you know. We, we, do, it, we don't need to do it manually. We okay. have to knock that dino out. Again. I'd suggest a tranquilizer, but you know, <laughs> you do you. Well, thank you. Um, yes, I'll do me. And we need to tranquilize him. We need to move him. Right. Now that we have control of the dinosaur, temporarily, let's get it transported to the paleo medical facility where we can treat its injuries. Yeah, okay, we need this one. Okay, what are you doing with him? Oh, you're disinfecting him? It will take another minute. Another minute. Okay. Let's speed up. And here in the corner you have the icon that shows you how much uh, time it's left, what the, what the progress is. Ready for transportation, so we need to transport him back. How do I do that? Part of the healing process is to get some rest. Preferably someplace comfortable. Always works for me. Same for the dinosaurs, I'd imagine. You imagine correctly. Not according to my ex. <laughs> mm. Yes, moving okay. on then. We yep. want to have the animal transported and then secure and comfortable in its enclosure, if you please. Sure. You go transport, but how do I transport? Aha, okay, you click on him and go here. Transport. And put him back in his enclosure. Yay, Washington complete! We completed the mission! <gasps> Yay! Congratulations to us. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I'm, I'm the best. I'm... <laughs> no, not really. But yeah, uh, this will be it for this episode. Thank you very much for watching. This was Washington State Mission. And uh, like, subscribe. You know all the stuff. I don't need to repeat. And hopefully I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.